Hey, players. So the Tennessee State House erupted into chaos after they ended the special session on public safety without getting anything done. Uh, the people in the gallery started chanting and they were very upset about this. And then there was some interaction between Justin Pearson and House Speaker Cameron Saxton. And it appears that, that yeah, y'all take a look at it. Of the state of Tennessee adjourned, Sonny Da. I hear Y'all, y'all let me know what y'all think about that in the comments, honey. Now, this is what Cameron Saxton and other uh, House representatives had to say about that interaction. The photographer, when you look at it, it was to my left. And so we moved right. And then at that point, we keep walking. And, and then, yeah, Representative Pearson comes in and pops me from the right side. And I can say I was standing right there. And what we'll happened up to that point, um, Representative Pearson became very irate and angry. Um, at that juncture, a circle around, and other members, myself and others, just kind of blocked folks off. There's no reason for any of that. Um, but there's no doubt in my mind that he was very angry and aggressive. I knew he was going to say aggressive. And there's just no need of that. We I declare, honey, what a disgrace. Now, many people are saying that the reason why this session was ended was because Justin Jones was going to... Uh, force a no confidence vote on Cameron Sexton. But in any event, they got absolutely nothing done and the Covenant parents, it was just so, so very sad to see them, you know, crying and just visibly upset. None of the things that they proposed actually made it to the floor for debate. It's so sad. They saw the bodies. Kids. So the special session is over. They got absolutely nothing done. Um, Governor Bill Lee, who approved the special session, he was nowhere to be uh, found. His tail was tucked between his legs. He wasn't a part of any of the negotiations, um, at least not with the Democrats, because they haven't spoken with him. And um, they did not take up any of the covenant parents, uh, the things that they had proposed. It's so sad. And this is all because the Republicans don't want to do anything about, really do anything about uh, gun reform. They don't want to do anything about that. And um, they also, Cameron Sexton is also scared of the no confidence vote. He doesn't want to see how it will turn out. I don't think he will be voted out, but I, I think that it's going to be very eye-opening for him. And I think he's scared. It's really damn ridiculous and a hot boo shitty mess, but covenant parents if you're really upset vote them out don't sit around here and 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 wait on them to do something for you show it in the polls if you are not happy with what these people have done scurry on down to the ballot box when it's time and get rid of them cameron saxton is not qualified to be the speaker of the house or even a representative he's not even uh, living in the district that he's representing i mean it's absurd Players, put your thoughts in the comments. Let me know what you're thinking. This is Double D Mo for the Black Eared News.